For this meal today, you'll be needing shrimp, Creole seasoning, garlic sriracha seasoning, and some seafood seasoning. We use the medium sized shrimp. You're going to need lettuce. I already buy the pre um, the pre shredded lettuce, iceberg lettuce, tomatoes, hoagie rolls, fish fry, and we're going to be using some of the smoked chipotle mustard. Alrighty, so first you're going to start off by seasoning your shrimp. You're going to add your Creole seasoning. I love to use Tony's, something that is a classic seasoning and very good. Now this is something new for my kitchen. It's the garlic sriracha seasoning. I did pick this up at Sam's Club. You're going to sprinkle a little of this. And then instead of Old Bay, we're going to use the Chef Paul Seafood Magic Seasoning. After you have added all of your seasonings in, you're going to give it a nice little toss. So that the seasonings can get on there evenly. And you don't want to use too much because your batter is already pre-seasoned. going to add your seasoned shrimp to your batter. Make sure that you shake off any excess juices. And you're going to give it a shake. Let's get ready to fry. Make sure that you shake off the excess batter and add it to your pan. We've now toasted the buns out of the oven and now getting buttered. So go ahead and prepare the po' boy. You're going to put just a little mustard on one side. And like I said, this is the smoked chipotle mustard. And then you're going to go ahead and add some of your mayonnaise. Now, one of my favorite mayonnaise is the Duke's mayonnaise. You're going to add that to the other side. And make sure you spread that evenly across your hoagie bun. Now, in most recipes, people use French bread. Uh, but the French bread that we purchased from Publix was a little bit too hard of our liking. So we did go with the hoagie bread and just toasted it and added butter. So the first thing that you're going to do is add your tomato slices to one side. You're going to go ahead and add the shrimp to the center. and top it off with a little lettuce or as much lettuce as you like. It's just a preference. And this completes our shrimp po' boy. Hope that you guys enjoyed it. Make sure that you check below for the details and make sure you tell a friend to subscribe and can't wait to see you at the next recipe.